Sometimes you gotta go big or go home. We're gonna take a look at the Grand Design Solitude. I don't know, I keep forgetting all the names. Too many numbers in our head today. 373 FBR. So right here at the show, MSRP of $118,415 with a sale price of just $97,731. What a bargain. Sounds like a full-time rig if you ask me. What's up, I'm Rachel. And I'm Joe. And we are Two, two crazy, crazy Campers. Campers. After losing a combined weight of more than 200 pounds. We realized we had so much more energy for activities. Come along with us as we explore the great outdoors. And join us on a brand new adventure. And this adventure leads us to some place we probably would never normally go. I'm gonna say that I probably shouldn't walk into this rig because I'm gonna walk into this rig and I'm gonna want it. Yeah. But we're gonna take a look at a very long, very gorgeous and very expensive fifth wheel from Grand Design. Let's go. Wow. Here, okay. Here is something I've always wanted in my own regular house. I'm ready to sell the house. Can we sell the house? I don't need to go any further. This kitchen is nicer than any kitchen I have seen in my house and any family member's house. This is awesome but let's take a closer look as we walk around okay i know you don't like dining room tables but con this is not a travel trailer this is a house this is beautiful but i, I want that i still like my booth i don't want a booth not in my house i don't want a booth in my house so look at this see oh we can watch tv and you have a little thing you have a cup holder there you have more couch over there a giant fireplace and you can see right there is your hideaway television. So much storage. Look at all of this storage. And again, I love this couch. And here's the other thing. Look at all of these windows. Like the amount of light that is gonna come in is just amazing. Let's take a closer look at the kitchen. I'm seeing right there, look at that giant lower cabinet. Look at all of that storage. Solid surface countertops. Hard cupboards. Looks like, I don't know if you, if this is a just, look at the size of that oven and that stove. I mean, that is huge. You're cooking Thanksgiving dinner in that thing. Now we have a nice big giant microwave up here on top. Some more cabinets up on top. You're a little short there. Right? And then we got another cabinet right next to it. Wow, okay, let's take a look at this pantry. Wow, wow, look at this pantry. Gorgeous. This is amazing. Now here I can get behind these drawers because it's behind this whole closet door and it's all part of the same system. Coming over here to the island, I love my islands. Just like, it's just storage upon storage upon storage. Seriously, it just keeps on going. Wow. Look at this sink. Look at the sink. Okay, I'm ready to go full time. Are you ready to go full time? I'm slowly being convinced by this thing. I'll tell you what. We want our kids to have a place to live. We'll sell the kids the house for what it's gonna cost us to live in this. Right? Okay, let's take a look at this fridge real quick. Look at this giant residential refrigerator. Nice light. I mean, oh, this is just awesome. Everything about this is awesome. Okay. Here we go. The test of grand design. Is the bathroom good? And I'm looking at the counter space in the half bath. Incredible amount of counter space and the perfect positioning for the toilet. They always get it right. Yep, and I'm just looking as you come out of there. So there's our door, right? You're gonna come up your door, slide is closed. This kitchen is on a slide. What's accessible when you come in with the slide closed? Your refrigerator? Your refrigerator because the other slide doesn't start till the end of that little bench. So what does that mean? This slide is gonna come in probably flush up against the countertop here. This slide over here is gonna come in probably flush up against the countertop. But this whole area is not under slide. 
What does that mean? You want to pull over, go to Walmart? Here we go. Here's our refrigerator so we can access our refrigerator. We can access our bathroom and turn around and walk up those steps. You can access your bedroom. And what a bedroom it is. Look at this. Now I am gonna say one thing about this. If you stand right there, the bedroom is on a slide or the bed is on a slide. So when the slide comes in, that means the bed is gonna be butt right up against these drawers. So if you do need to access the bedroom with the slides closed, you're gonna be able to access it, but you'll have to kind of climb onto the bed. Right. That is the only thing you'll have to worry about there. But look at that. You want to put your shoes on? This is the first time that I've seen this kind of thing. And there's two of them. Wow. And I like this. Traditional roller shades. Like yeah. none of those flimsy, like, you know, up and down. And every time you touch them, they're off the crinkly. We have our nice television here. Nice little armoire here. Beautiful dresser. We've got on each side of the bed a place to put our CPAP along with plugs. Sliding door, which I love. We didn't even notice this. Look at this. Storage. Storage underneath there. Coming into the bathroom. His and hers sinks. This is amazing. Look at the counter space. This is just amazing. Drawers. Look at this. Tons of storage. Okay, let's take a look at this closet. What? Are you kidding me? Are you kidding me? Look at this. I want this at home. And you got a place for a washer and dryer. Wow. Wow, this is gorgeous. Let's check out the bathtub. Nice big shower and I can sit down to shave my legs which I love that is awesome here we go always they never disappoint and let me tell you you go to the bathroom a lot you're using this a lot there's a lot of stuff that you can be like all right I can do without it or I'm not going to be dealing with it every single day you are going to be dealing with the toilet every single day so if it's a terrible toilet in a rotten position it's going to aggravate you you know what this is really good for? Mm -hmm. A couple. Absolutely. A full-time couple because there's no bunks in here. No, there's not. This, you know, you can go stick the grandkids if they're visiting you for a day or two out on the couches or something like that. There is no bed in here. There's no extra beds. This, is, this a, is you and me. Hit the road. Let's hit every national park in this country. This is a mommy daddy. Okay, so starting up here in the front, this is going to be our bathroom slide. And look at the giant awning over your head there, Rachel, for wow. the main entrance. And lit. And then we have here, we have our propane. And giant basement storage. Now we can just put the grandkids in here. Here you go. Put a bed in here. We're good to go. Okay, keep going down. So this is a single door. So here's our shower hookup. We've got some electrical plugs here. The fold above steps, we all know what I think of those. Here's our living room slide. And I like this, the living room slide actually has its own awning. Here's our ladder, class four hitch, so we can tow some stuff behind us, although I don't recommend towing something behind a fifth wheel. No. Um, now down below here, I do see our gray water pole. Not super happy about it being under a slide. And then over here is going to be all of our hookups and everything. So now this is our main kitchen slide. We got over here our black tank flush. The other side of our pass through storage. Double doors. And then we've got here our wet bay and we do have auto level. And then what's up here in the front? We got a bay to put our generator and then of course our batteries. I'm ready to move. You're ready to move. I'm ready to move. Are you ready to move? I think that this is such a great rig. Now we have seen where you can drop $100,000 easy at this show, right? On all sorts of things. But I feel like this one has all the bells and whistles, which kind of justify a price tag. Okay, well, give me a plus. The plus is definitely going to be that kitchen. That is an absolutely gorgeous kitchen made with really good materials that are, it's not going to fall apart. 
Right. No, no. I have to tell you, for me, <laughs> that closet is pretty awesome. I'm surprised Amazing. it's not yours. I'm gonna mention the closet. But I like the wraparound windows in the living space. Gorgeous. That is just amazing. With but, the con. Yeah, we have to have a con. So I think for me, I'm going full time. This is all our storage. Ugh. That's it. We, we've got one storage bay here. Because you have all those extra slides and stuff. That That is definitely something you're going to have to think about. Yeah. So what about you? Man, trying to find a con. What is a con in this? Man. I'm going to go like something so dumb, but like the dinette set. I, I'm always not, I just don't like tables and chairs. Why? I just don't. I want a booth. But it's like you're full timing in it. I would full time booth it. Okay. Well, that's going to be the end of this video. Please do us a favor. Hit the like button down below and also make sure you subscribe to our channel. It really does help build us up. And don't forget to click the little bell icon and that way every single time you upload a new video, you'll be alerted to it. Until next time. Happy, happy camping. camping.